all right guys i'm back with another video i do i love to sit down videos i will have more of these really no cuts really straight to the point getting right to it i want to get right into it it's just uh body game women do care about your body game everything like that and pretty much give you like advice and really understand like this is a thing you know what i mean and i want you guys to understand that sometimes women will not like for me to really expose it or really to talk about it because this is something that women will not tell you i'm saying women will not tell you any of these things it's pretty much like secrets um pretty much attraction is like that women are not going to tell you exactly what they're attracted to but basically attractive women do care about your body game and everything like that and you know what i'm saying they also care about like your stature you feel me a lot of times um just to be 100 with y'all be honest with y'all like in atlanta like where i'm at atlanta is not safe at all locations at all times you know what i'm saying so when you are dating when you are going out there are going to be women that are going to look for a man who can who's able to protect them physically and you'll notice like the more better your physique the better you are physically you'll notice that you deter a lot of people trying you and your girl or you your woman your mom everything like that that's why i tell you guys to practice body game because you just never know what people's intentions are but when you have like a body full of armor body full of muscle it deters a lot of interactions negative interactions from your life because people just understand that like if you were to fight them or you know what i'm saying if it was to be a situation or altercation both y'all gonna be fucked up you know what i'm saying both y'all gonna be have bruises black eyes everything like that because you're able to defend yourself so it's more of a uh, equal fight and a lot of times people don't like that people like to be the dominant person in the fight but you know what I'm saying when you practice body game that's something that people have to second guess or think about like okay if i do punch this super jack guy i'm gonna get punched back you feel me like that and it's just like women look for that because it's like security is protection and while they're pumping gas they want to make sure that like nobody is trying them nobody's like hitting them on the butt nobody's trying to talk to them you know what i'm saying it just it just makes it simple it, you know to where a woman can relax and be more her feminine but if you don't have that you'll notice that women will be kind of more argumentative because they don't feel safe with you they don't feel comfortable they don't feel like you can protect them so they feel like they have to be more on the masculine side or more aggressive because they just feel like okay if push comes to shove i gotta defend both of us you feel me so it's like having a more masculine physique just makes your life easier you know what i'm saying it causes a lot you know what I'm saying it causes a better time for you and your girl for you just walking doing your thing because you know what i'm saying if you are dating and attracting women guys are going to approach them like if you i don't know if you guys are like around attractive women or are used to attractive women or like uh, like that but they get harassed like attractive women probably not even really that attractive women just like probably decent women too they get harassed bro like women i want you guys to understand this as men like women get harassed on a daily basis whether it be on social media whether it be in person whether it be from like their actual boyfriends or husbands like it's really crazy out here and i want you guys to be able to protect because you know what i'm saying you don't want your girl you don't want your sister you don't want your mom going through that stuff cousins whatever like that so it's just like you want to make sure that like you're able to protect them the best way you can you know what i'm saying I'm not saying like start things or kind of be argumentative argumentative or whatever like that but just understand that like if a problem was to rise around a woman uh no matter if it's family or not they're going to look for you to protect them whether if you have the muscles or the armor or protection or whatever like that or not they're going to be looking for you to protect them like for an example if somebody was to come into a store and harm the first thing that they're gonna look for is the men to come up and protect everybody in the the women and children you know what i'm saying it's just like it's natural it's innate it's through evolution so i don't want you guys to go against biology i always say that because it does it's not smart so that's why i want you guys to understand that women find that attractive women are looking for that because you will see things like to where um women may not well no 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 men may not look at height you know what i'm saying that might not be a requirement but sometimes for women that's a requirement for a safety issue so it's like if you don't really necessarily have the height at least have the muscle to you know what I'm saying back that up because you know what I'm saying if you're tall and jack it's like pretty much nobody's really gonna try you like that because they understand that like you can most likely tend nine times out of ten defend yourself you know what I'm saying or you been in fights or whatever like that so same thing with me it's like 
I've been in fights, I've understand like you know said so defending yourself it's just what comes with it you know so i've been in sports or whatever so i just want you guys to understand that especially if you are a younger guy just understand that like women find that attractive I mean, women are looking for that and it's like it's not saying that one guy is better than the other but understand that women are looking for that for protection the next thing is society standards when a woman is presenting their do their guy to other people other women they are looking for validation. You know what I'm saying? It's like they don't want the guy to get too much validation, but at the same time, they want to have a pat on the back of saying like, okay, this is the guy that I am talking to or dating. And they want to make sure that the, the guy can protect the girl. You know what I'm saying? They're looking to see like, okay, is the guy strong enough? You know what I'm saying? Is the guy masculine? You know what I mean? And it's just like, these are things that men don't really necessarily think about, but this is something that you should think about on a daily basis when you're thinking about getting into the gym or thinking of getting into the body game. Because, you know, they're group chats, you know what I'm saying? They're group chats. Women communicate all the time and they're always, they're always looking for information, seeking information and sharing information. So it's like when you are a part of a woman's life, they are looking to you to protect, but also to get validation from their friends. So it's just like, if you are a strong guy, she's looking at too like if y'all all were to hang out you'll be able to protect them you know what i'm saying you'll be able to handle a situation or you'll be able to have them be more at ease because they feel like it's a masculine figure there so that's what i want you guys to understand also is that women are looking to also have that validation for their friends and their family when they're looking at you so you want to make sure that you are physically fit you know what i'm saying you want to make sure that you are jacked if you can because that is an attractive trait that women are going to look for is that that goes in the body game because it's like the more physically fit your body is from society they're going to deem that more attractive because you're able to protect you know what i'm saying it's not always about looks and money it's not always about like what you can do for them what you can buy for them and all that it's also how well you can protect them you know what i'm saying because it's like like i can have a ton of money and everything like that but if he can't if the woman doesn't feel safe she's gonna be more combative she's gonna be more aggressive because it's like it's already not a good feeling that a woman is having to take the leadership role and protecting both of you guys it's also like it's not deemed as attractive from validation from her friends and from social media and everything like that so it's like they they look at that they because they're concerned about that and they actually focus on that when they're selecting a guy you know what i mean they're always asking okay like uh, is he in shape? Is he tall? It's like it's certain things that even men that we do for requirements for women to have. So it's like don't think that women don't have that same thing going on. You know what I mean? Like just don't go against biology. That's the best thing to go about it. That's the best way to say it. You know what I'm saying? And uh, also too, um, even for like for men, for men too, men look for that too. Just for like, can you protect? You know what I'm saying? Can you protect? Can you even be in this group? To where you can protect it, you know what I'm saying. If anything was to happen for safety, gang students, all to, every everybody does this in groups. They're looking who's the strongest, who's the most masculine, and that's attractive for women. You know what I'm saying? They're seeing like, okay, this group is the strongest. This is, these are the guys I want to talk to. You know what I mean? And that's why sports is so successful. Also, too, um, you know, what I'm saying why it matters to women also for like body game is that simple attraction, lust, everything like that. It's just like. You do have to have a level of attraction when you're dealing with a woman or you're dating because the woman still needs to be physically attracted to you. And a lot of times through muscles and through working out, having that V taper, subconsciously they're gonna be attracted and drawn to that. It's like more of a magnetism. Yeah, it's more of a, like a magnetism effect, you know what I'm saying? It's more so like, oh my God, I'm just so drawn to this, you know what I'm saying? I just like this. And they don't know why, but it's just they're hardwired to be that way. Men are hardwired to be that way also through evolution and biology for, the, you know what I'm saying, the uh, survival of the fittest, you know what I mean? So just keep that in mind, understand that also, and then understand that like, you know what I'm saying, the better your body looks, the more easier your interactions with women will be. So I'm not saying like just because your body is just fit, it's, everything is gonna be easy, but it's gonna be easier if it's more fit than if it wasn't. Because at the same time, if they're comparing you to somebody else, you know what I mean? They're gonna be like, well, at least he has this. At least he has the V taper. At least he can protect me. At least he's strong enough to pick me up, lift me up. You know what I'm saying? It's just like, it's different things that women think about that you may not understand 
And I don't want you guys to get passed up on that because you don't know. You don't know what's going on. You know what I mean? Don't be confused, but be smart about it. You know what I mean? But yeah, that's pretty much the end of the video. I just want to tell you guys about that. Just pretty much brush up on those topics. Let you guys know that that's something that you need to think about when you're going to your day-to-day -day life. You're living your day-to-day -day life. If you're in school, if you're in the workplace, corporate, it, it's the same thing. You know what I'm saying? It's the same principles. And don't feel like it ever changes because it doesn't. But yeah, that's the end of the video. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. And I'm out. <laughs>